Welcome back to the Roundtable. I'm your host, Ostrich Vox. Now let me ask you a question. Are you excited for the premiere of OKKO OK Let's Be Heroes next week? I know I am. You know who's going to be watching? I am. You know who's not going to be watching? Probably the intended audience. At least, not as much as there could be, and that's all because of, you guessed it, Teen Titans Go. Next week's Cartoon Network schedule has an entire week of Teen Titans Go. Nothing but Teen Titans Go besides OKKO OK and its premieres. And like, one or two reruns. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. That's an entire four days. At this current point in time, it looks like Friday has a normal schedule. But does that really excuse anything else? Now, I've strayed away from talking about how Teen Titans Go pollutes the schedule of Cartoon Network because, honestly, it's its number one show, it's its money maker, but this is ridiculous, and I believe this will hurt OKKO. OK Over recent months, the Teen Titans Go oversaturation has begun to hurt Cartoon Network's ratings. Yeah, we knew what happened eventually, but it began to affect its own premieres. While Teen Titans Go premieres are still pretty high up on the Cartoon Network ratings, premieres used to get around 2 million viewers. They get half of that now. So you're probably wondering, what gives? Why are they doing this? Our guess is because next week, Teen Titans Go is going to have a four-night event. The night begins to shine. You remember that cool-looking episode of Teen Titans Go a while back? The one that even fans of the original series didn't hate? Yeah, they realized they struck gold there, so now they're doing an entire miniseries of it. That's kind of taking it too far. So Cartoon Network, your solution to build up hype for this is to air Teen Titans Go for an entire week? You're absolutely insane. This isn't me coming at Teen Titans Go. This isn't even about Teen Titans Go anymore. This is about oversaturation. Let's say they did this with Steven Universe. Yeah, at first everybody would be like, yeah, finally the best show gets a spotlight. Trust me, Steven Universe was 50% of the Cartoon Network schedule and then became 72% of the Cartoon Network schedule, airing four days straight aside from OKKO. OK Maybe the true hardcore fans wouldn't mind, but think about the children, the actual demographic. They ain't gonna be sticking along to the theme song much longer. This is the exact same issue Cartoon Network's had in the past with shows like Johnny Test, airing it over and over and over again. And I know the scheduling department at Cartoon Network gets paid to carefully analyze the schedules and optimize it to its best degree to curate a schedule that the demographic will enjoy. But I don't care. Granted, yeah, I'm 19. I'm outside of Cartoon Network's demographic now. But when I was a kid, I would hate this. Remember when Cartoon Network aired the Iron Giant for 24 hours straight? During the first few airings, I was eating it up. But by the end of that marathon, I could not watch another second of the Iron Giant. Why? Because it was the only thing on Cartoon Network. I was a Cartoon Network kid. I lived and breathed Cartoon Network. That marathon turned me off from that movie for the longest time. I completely swore it off. Granted, my love for the film came back a few years later, but it was just nothing, nothing but, but the Iron, Iron Giant. Giant. And then when the weekend was over, I would go see my friends and they'd be like, yeah, that was too much. I had to watch Nickelodeon or something. The point is, don't air a single show for four days straight. Aside from OKKO, OK which you guys should watch because it's really cool. But what do you guys think? How do you feel about Teen Titans Go for an entire week straight? Okay, I already know what the answer is going to be. This show sucks. Cancel it. Like I said, I don't hate Teen Titans Go. I think it gets too much shit, but this is ridiculous. Let's get a discussion going in the comment section below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please do a like, and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button, it really helps us out. Follow us on social media, hit the little notification bell so you can never miss cartoon news. Ostrich Vox, signing out. This video has been powered by Patreon. If you want to give us some more support, head to patreon.com slash roundtablevids, become a patron, and get some awesome perks. Thanks for watching another video on the Roundtable. If you want to get more involved with our community and watch videos from Let's Talk of Tom, Voxbox, and more, click the video right here. Or if you want to get some more of the animation goodness, watch some Crystal Clear or Mini Monday, click the video right here. And please, don't forget to subscribe.